Hey babes and welcome back to my channel. It is Smoked Alive and today we're going to be going through my go-to pieces in my closet. So if you're interested in this video then keep watching and if you're not then don't keep watching but don't give me a thumbs down. I'm <laughs> just playing. But yeah if you're interested in this video just keep watching. So first off, I just want to go through my accessories because I love accessories and my favorite accessories are chokers. I love them. So let's go through some of my favorite chokers. So starting off with one of my favorite chokers is this guy right here and then there's this beautiful Victorian choker and I love this. I did get it downtown Portland, Oregon, but they have a ton of these on like Dolls Kill or really just type in chain chokers and so many will pop up. So moving right along, or this video is gonna be like two billion hours. My second favorite choker is this red one, and I love it. It is actually a plush velvet material. Ooh, there's a little hair. It's a velvet material, and it just has the circle right here in the middle, and I like it because it's really skinny, it's simple, and it's a really great pop of color, and I did get this on the website. Dolls Kill on the website, on dollskill.com. Dollskill.com, oh my goodness. I did get this at, moving along, Dolls Kill, you get my drift. So moving on to some other accessories that I love is this bracelet right here. It has, I don't, reminds me of a doorknob, like an old doorknob, like, you know what I'm saying? In the old like creepy haunted movies or whatever. So this is a bracelet and I love this. I love how chunky it is. It is perfect. It is a perfect statement piece. I think it's absolutely beautiful. And I'm just obsessed with this. Right? Another Dolls Kill accessory item. The majority of bracelets and things that I get are from Dolls Kill. I love Dolls Kill, especially their accessories. So this is a hand bracelet here. It goes all the way around. It has two holes right here and then it goes through the middle finger. So I think this is so freaking cool. I just love this. I love like that kind of like a glove look. I don't know. I just think this is super unique. Again, I think it would look really cool with like a baggy t-shirt, leather jacket and just throw this on with some sneakers. It's like a perfect statement piece. Love this guy. And another accessory piece that I do love are these studded earrings. I love wearing studded earrings. I got these downtown Portland, but these again are just a square studded earring. They have so many. I also have a circle black pair, which I did get on Amazon. Just type in studs. I love studs. But my second go-to piece for earrings is hoops. And these are big hoops. My mom got me them for Christmas and they attach like this. And I just love hoops. I think they're so cute. I think they're very edgy and punky and different and I really, really like them. So let's move on to my clothes. Oh, and if you're curious, my mom did get these hoops on Amazon. She just typed in big hoops and the big. So starting out with my clothes, I'm obsessed with leather jackets. That's like, if I could just live in a leather jacket, I would. I love them. I want every single kind of leather jacket and every single color. They are my favorite thing ever. Definitely my go-to staple piece. They go with any outfit, either dressy or casual, whatever. They, I love them. So this is a leather jacket that I did get. I'm obsessed with this. Sorry, it's very big for the frame. I tried to do this standing up, but it didn't work. So it's a really cool inside with the plaid and the whole thing is just studded. Like if you look at the arms, like, ah! and the back is really cool too. It's got some detailing on the shoulders and then also down at the bottom. <sighs> okay, so this leather jacket is actually a knockoff of a brand called Killstar. So the Killstar brand has dope leather jackets, but they're literally like $530 or something nuts. So I got this jacket online on eBay. And so what I did is I typed in knock off Killstar jackets and this literally popped right up. It looks the exact same as the other one. This one is just $130 instead of $530. This is by the brand Crab Rocks. It's actually really hard to find it by looking through that. So just type in knock off Killstar jacket and you will find them because they have a bunch. And I love this. This is my 
Number one favorite leather jacket. Moving on. Unif is another place that I absolutely love getting my jackets from. And this is my second favorite leather jacket. And this is just the plain leather jacket with cheetah sleeves and these dope studs. Like I love these studs. They're like thick triangle, like they look like bullets. That's a good way to put it. They're like bullet studs and that's actually what they're called. And this again is just from Unif. You can type in Unif leather jacket. They do not have it in stores anymore, but you can find it on eBay, sometimes Amazon here and there, it will pop up and other places like that. Polyvore, Polyvore, one of those. They carry a lot of Unif jackets, but this is just the cheetah Unif jacket. And I love it. I think it is the perfect statement piece to go with any color, red, pink, blue, green, whatever you want. This is amazing. And again, I do have many other leather jackets, but those are my two favorites. So let's move on to some of my other favorite statement jackets. This first one is actually from Ross. It is a boys jacket and it just looks like this. I have worn it in a video and the back goes here. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> and it does, this is really loud. It does have some ties here at the bottom. And I really, really like this for the days where I'm just like chilling, wanna put on some like basketball shorts or some sweats and just throw on this jacket. I think it's a very cute way to kind of dress up that sweat, hair tie, no makeup on, that kind of deal. I love this and I got it at Ross in the boys section and actually it's my brother's. <laughs> so this jacket is gonna be very difficult to show, but this is a boys long, bomber jacket from H&M and it is by the brand Trademark. So it's a big bomber jacket as you can see and it's so sick because it has this bright red plaid under it which I love. And this is pretty much a trench coat. Like it really is. I mean it goes all the way down and it has these big pockets and I love this jacket. I think it's perfect to wear a dress underneath it and then put that on over the top or wear like um, exercise pants with sneakers and that over the top. It's the perfect, cute, warm jacket. Like it is so warm. It's basically like having a blanket. It goes below my knees and it's so comfortable and I love it. Again, H&M and they do have them and they do have them in stores right now. They are on sale. I got this for like 30 bucks and it's originally like a hundred so check it out so that is it for my go-to jackets you need leather jackets a bomber jacket and a fun exercise outfit and you are good to go so let's move on to my purses so one of my go-to pieces which i showed in my last video is this fanny pack again it is on amazon type in studded fanny pack there you go no need to expand because i just showed it so the other favorite purse that i i freaking love. I actually got this for Christmas and it is this guy right here. And it is just a furry cheetah purse with a chain on it. You can either have it long or short. I love this guy. This is from the brand, I think Voodoo. Don't judge me. Voodoo Vixen is what the brand is. And I got this on Dolls Kill. Again, it is very cheap. They don't have any online right now. But if you go on to Voodoo Vixen, they should have something very similar and or the same thing. Just type in red leather. Oh, and I love this because you can sleep on it. Not red leather, red fur. And let's go on to some of my favorite staple flannels. So I absolutely love boy clothes and I do not go anywhere without flannels. If you know me and you see me, I'm always wearing flannels. I'm obsessed with flannels. I think they're the most cutest, most comfortable, punky, edgy things ever. So this is one of my absolute favorites and it is a red plaid. And again, this is boys. It's very long. It goes past my butt. I do have a picture of it on my Instagram. I will insert it somewhere around here. So it has this super sick zipper all the way down at the bottom, which is my favorite detailing. So it's not just like a normal flannel. It's like a punky, edgy flannel. I love this guy. This is from the brand. Uh, Bricks. It's called Bricks. And this is an Asian or Japanese brand. And my mom got it for my husband for Christmas. And I love it. 
again with the zipper flannels this is my second favorite and it has a zipper at the back it is this bright teal i love it for a pop of color everything would look really good with my outfit and makeup right now <laughs> this is from h and m and it is by the brand divided and also trademark so i don't know if they did like a cloak collab like a co collaboration together it says trademark here at the bottom which i love little detailings this is very long this is like a dress every time i wear it someone thinks it's a dress and i love it this is a very justin bieber pop style and again this is only like 30 dollars, but i got it on sale for like 10 so check h&m out they have amazing flannels Okay, so next we're going to go through my go-to long sleeves. So my number one go-to long sleeve is a fishnet shirt. This is white and it is see-through and it is fishnet. I do have this also in black, which I purchased this on the Dolls Kill website, but this is by Trip NYC and they have really comfortable, cheap fishnet shirts. So fishnet shirts, I love. You will always see me in them. I think they're perfect to go under a band t-shirt or over top or over top under a leather jacket for some cool detailing on the chest. I love fishnet shirts. I think they're amazing and they're just a perfect statement piece. So my second go-to long sleeve shirt is this one by Jeffrey Star himself. And it is this guy right here and it has lip glosses on the sleeve. So this says, God bless lip gloss. I think it's super funny. Everyone needs a statement sweatshirt that is funny and colorful. And I just really, really like this. It's fun to throw on with some jeans or some leather pants or some boots. You can wear do whatever you want with it. But I really, really like this guy. I think it's hilarious how it has a lip gloss crosses and it says, God bless lip gloss. I love Jesus and I love lip gloss. So this is my jam. Again, this, um, if you didn't know, Jeffree Star's clothing line is actually called Beauty Forever, and this is on beautyforeverco.com. But I did get, did, I did get mine on alligatorpaper.com. I'll link it down below. But yeah, moving right along. So I don't think any wardrobe is complete without a t-shirt. I love black and white t-shirts, I love statement t-shirts, and I'm obsessed with cutoffs. You have to have cutoffs, and you have to have t-shirts. Otherwise, you don't have a wardrobe. So my favorite t-shirt that I own is actually this by Killstar. It is super sick. It's just a black and white tee. Has some really cool, cool old English and some stars. I think it's a super sick statement piece. It would go really awesome with a flannel over the top or a leather jacket or just by itself. I really, really love t-shirts. You can dress them up and you can dress them down. Again, that was by Killstar Co. And I did get it on dollskill.com. Um, cutoffs. I love cutoffs. They're my favorite summer item. I just, I love them. So my favorite cutoffs are actually by Unif and this is one of my favorite cutoffs that I own. I think this is super fun and actually goes to an ombre. It's kind of like a lighter black to a really dark black. I don't know if you can tell, but again, this is by Dolls Kill. All of their cutoffs are actually unisex. So I have an extra small or a small and they're still pretty baggy on me. So go smaller with these guys, but these are amazing. I think they're perfect quality. I've had this for over two years now and it looks brand new. These last forever and they are absolutely worth the high price tag. So let's move on to my favorite go-to exercise chill wear. So one of my favorite pieces is actually by Crooks and Castles. And it is these exercise pants that say crooks on them. They're actually leggings and I think they are so cute. Let's move this hanger. So on the other side, it says um, feminine fatal. I just think these are absolutely adorable. They go down in skinny jeans. I think they look perfect with any pair of tennis shoes, a chunky uh, flannel and a baggy shirt. I cannot go without some type of exercise leggings. These are again by Crooks and Castles and I did get them on karmaloop.com and they are fairly cheap for the price that you, for the price that you get, for the quality. They're like really, really high quality and I absolutely love these. You can never have too much sweats. You just cannot. I'm obsessed with leggings and sweats. You just can't have enough. It's all I wear. I live in sweats. So these are one of my favorite sweats and they're just this 
crazy pattern here. And I have taken an Instagram picture in them, so I will put it somewhere, not link it, put it somewhere up here. These are actually from dollskill.com and the specific people brand is long clothing. Again, that is long, long clothing. And so these are actually just the joggers. These are actually just the joggers. I can't talk. So these are just joggers and they go all the way down to the ankle and get skinnier. And I love these. I think these look super rad with a flannel, a leather jacket or a sweatshirt, a baggy t-shirt, whatever you want to wear. You cannot have enough joggers in your life. So another thing that I think you cannot live without are some basketball shorts. I love chilling in some basketball shorts. So these are by the brand London and they look like this. This is the front and then the back is pretty cool and it says London again. And I love these. I think these look so dope. Like just putting on a pair of Converse with some high socks and a baggy t-shirt or even like a tight crop top or anything like that. I just I love them. They're so comfortable, they're quite airy. And these were actually purchased on AliExpress.com and AliExpress is so cheap, it's very Japanese inspired and you can get stuff for like $5. Basketball shorts for the win. I do not believe that you can have a closet without some leather leggings or some type of strappy leggings and a fun overall. So, my absolute favorite pair of pants that I own are these right here. They strap all the way down. These are, where did I get them? Oh, get these out of the hangup. These are from Midnight Hour and I got them on oh, blackheart.com. It is like the lingerie website for Hot Topic, but they also have clothes. They have lingerie and clothes. So these are the pants here. They have little ties right at the top. And again, they go all the way down and they are in a velvet material. You cannot, absolutely not, have a closet without some type of velvet pant. I love velvet pants. I think they add such a statement piece to your outfit and make any regular leggings unboring. So these leggings are from the store Love Culture. They were very cheap and they have these dope pattern here. So the square right here covering my mouth is what actually goes over the knee. And it's really cool because I have some holes. So it's like some ties to a hole to some more ties. I love these. It has a very like heavy metal vibe to it, which I love heavy metal inspired clothing. I think it's beautiful. If I could wear like a full on leather studded heavy metal outfit every day, I would, but it's very expensive. So this is about as good as it's gonna get. So these are super awesome, very comfortable, and very cheap. Go ahead and check out Love Culture. If you have not tried the crunchy peanut butter cliff bar, you gotta try it. I need some protein. I'm gonna pass out before I finish this video. I checked my phone while we're at it. It's five o'clock. Oh my gosh, I've already been filming for like an hour and a half. Nah. Okay, so I pretty much live in leather leggings. There's nothing better than putting on a tight leather legging. Here you go. What they look like. They're long and they're leathery. And these are actually high-waisted, which I really, really like these. You um, just type in... I got these on Amazon and I just typed in high waisted leather leggings. They have so many in like every color you could ever think of. And I really, really like these because they go all the way up to your belly button. They keep everything nice and tucked in and they look very slimming. I just really, really like these and I will never, ever not wear these. Even when I'm an old lady, like 90, I'm going to be like, Look at my leather leggings. I love them. Like I said, another statement piece is from dollskill.com. These are actually from Trip NYC, which I love them, and they are just an overall with holes. I love these. I think they're a perfect, fun statement piece. I think you always need some type of color, even though you're a black junkie like me. I love black. Oh, I just love it. So 
Um, I really like anything with rips, so that's why I specifically like these because the entire leg is full of holes. And again, this is an overall. <laughs> So the top looks like this. I think they're so cute. And again, these are from Dolls Kill and it is Trip NYC. So let's move on to my favorite fancy statement pieces. So one of my favorite statement pieces is this leather bra right here. This is from Unif. Again, they have a ton of these, unif.com, check them out. I love these because it is it does, whoa, it is exactly like this. It just puts some pizzazz to a normal tank top. I would never just wear this bra and that's it. Like, I don't think that's appropriate, but I really love wearing detailed bras to add some detailing to your collarbone and chest. I think it's really fun and different. See, just, it's cool. This is my favorite one. This is a cheetah, beautiful one. And again, from Unif. So my second favorite statement piece is actually this beach cover. So this is a complete fishnet skirt. I think it's so cool and it has these straps that hang down. Let me show you. So it looks like, <laughs> it looks like this as the two straps that hang down. I think it is so cool. I got this on Karma Loop and the brand is See You Monday Los Angeles. No, I do not wear this with just that. I'm not like, no offense to Kylie Jenner or anything, but I'm not Kylie Jenner in it in a completely see-through skirt with my underwear walking around. I do not think that's appropriate. But these look super sick pieces like this to go over leather leggings or to put shorts underneath in the summer or to wear like a skirt underneath. I think it's really fun detail. I just, I love it. It's just like an edgy skirt and a way to just pop any regular outfit together and pop it and make it look dressy. Yeah? Yeah. I don't know where that swimming thing came from. <laughs> Moving along. So this is like my favorite piece. <laughs> and this is from the brand Widow. I love the brand Widow. I think it's, they just have the coolest pieces ever. So this is actually a dress, which I'm like, girl, I put this on and like my booty showing like that much and my other areas are just everywhere. I do not see how this is a dress. Also, this is a medium. Look how skinny this is. It's like as big as my face. So if you're gonna get something from Widow, size up because they are very tiny. But this is one of my absolute favorite pieces ever. So it is just a black wife beater. Oh, I can't hold it. <laughs> it is black. <laughs> It is a wife beater tank top here, and it just has these straps on it. I think it's so cool, these little strap detailings. I love it. I think it's so BA, and this is not a dress. It's just not. So what I like to wear this with is leather leggings, and then these on top, and it just kind of adds a dressy feel to your leggings and with these little straps on the bottom. It's just, I don't love it. And I can't get enough of it. And I would wear this so much more if it wasn't white. Again, this is a medium. It almost doesn't fit me. It is like, like I feel like everything's gonna like fall out. So get a, another size. But again, this is from Widow and I did purchase this on killstar.com, but they do have their own website. <laughs> All right, guys, that is it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up. If you would like a shoe collection video next, let me know because I have lots of shoes that I would love to show you guys. And I really hope you enjoyed it. I really, really love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. And I hope to see you guys next week. Bye.